Round two highlights from Latino America Tours Dominican Republic Open held at Teeth of the Dog. And we'll start it off on the ninth hole. Christian Espinoza. This is his third shot. He put together a bogey free round on Friday. This is his last hole of the day. With wedge in hand, he's able to get himself within a couple feet for a birdie look to get to four under par. And Espinoza will finish at four under overall with a three under 69 on Friday. So he is certainly in the mix as we head into the weekend. Diego Velasquez now at four under par. This is his tee shot on the par three fifth. He had a roller coaster day with a lot of birdies and also a lot of bogeys. He's coming off back to back bogeys actually heading into this fifth hole, but bounces back here with a six foot birdie to move to five under par overall. And he would finish one under on his day. Beautiful views there from the Dominican Republic. Ocean views all over this course. Great to play, just as fun to watch from your computer screen. Rodolfo Casabon, second on the order of merit off the strength of three top 10 finishes. So it's no surprise to see him right in the mix after 36 holes. That was an eagle attempt, which he missed, but would go on to make birdie there to move to five under par, which is where he will finish heading into the weekend. He was three under on his day. Jose Toledo had a runner-up finish last year. Still searching, though, for that first win. Has a top 10 finish already this season. This is his third shot on the 15th. Nearly chips in, but instead kicks that in for a par save. He will finish at six under overall in a tie for first with this man, Keith Mitchell. This is his rookie season. Has already carded one top 10 on the year. And he finds himself atop the leaderboard tied with Toledo. Began the day one under, but a five under 67 puts him right there heading into the weekend.